praise jesus welcome back to my channel if you're new here i'm becky having you awesome fun and timely content on all my platforms so make sure you like you comment you share and you definitely subscribe allow me to lock this door and position you guys a bit different i think that 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 honestly should it should be better how are you guys doing if you're here for your first time hi i'm becky and i'm an i'm your new bestie you just don't know it yet because you have not subscribed please subscribe if you enjoy my content if you indulge please click that subscribe button i would really 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 appreciate so today as you've seen from the title we are doing something different i am trying to bring everything everything to the table but serve it differently if you get what i mean so today we have a grocery haul and hopefully a pantry and fridge organization those i know i'll do tomorrow because as i'm speaking to you it's currently 5 30 p.m i have just gotten back uh from the shops and i'm exhausted oh my goodness water that i just boiled to drink all right we'll try again after this video I am exhausted, but I thought I would show you what I buy uh, on a monthly. Last month was uh, our first month living together. So the shopping we did was huge. It was so much. We bought everything we need for the house. So that was a lot. But then this month I have just uh, restocked on what we need. So the things I'm showing you are supposed to last us a month, which they did last month. I think the only thing we restocked was like buns and we got beef strips. Yeah. And the only thing that was in my budget, <coughs> excuse me, the only thing that was in my budget that I have not gotten because it was too expensive is chicken. So I'll get that. I'll, I'll order that from Globo. It should be cheaper. So toiletries, I got some tissue you can never have enough of tissue guys we get this extra strong rosy the 10 rolls and this lasts us a whole month so invest in good quality tissue it will last that lasts us a month and then this is the soap we use imperial leather japanese spa i just like the way it smells honestly there's nothing deep about it and it actually does last a month because I personally have a shower gel. So we use shower gel with this. And then uh, this is the soap I have gotten. I don't know how you guys are adjusting with these economic times. You know, we, we are of Christ. He's provided above and beyond everything we need for life and godliness. But... Um, yeah, we are living in a world that is so unfair. So in these times, please change brands. Your clothes will not, they will not tear. I promise they will not. Please do not, please do not end on that hill of high end. I don't know what. If you need to, please do. Because I am trying out this toast. I've seen it advertised a lot. So I hope it works. Because if it doesn't, I'll come here and see it. All right. So toss. I hope. This works. Anywho, so that is in the toiletry department. I have every other thing. I have Jik. I have, um, what is this thing called? I have Vim. I have toilet cleaner. I have uh, um, my kitchen cleaner. I have, I have bar soap. So you see, I'm just restocking. Then for the bulk of what we have gotten today, which is mostly food stuff, we will start with buns. This is a staple in our home. And we're remaining with one and we restocked one this month. So we bought one at the end of the month. And we bought another like two days ago. Because uh, I ate two. Alright. So if I had not eaten them with eggs in the morning, it would have gotten to the end of the month. So you just need... It's not, it's not girl math, but it is math math. Alright. <laughs> so this one... Am I supposed to see the prices, honestly? Let's see. This will take so long. The toss is uh, 305. 
and then the bathing soap is 269 and then the tissue is 394 then the buns it's a festive festive buns 127 bob and then i got cheese we got the cerimon let me tell you people i don't <laughs> I'm not very iffy about cheese, honestly, for as long as it works. Cheese is cheese to me. So for as long as it works in my pasta, it will work in my, uh, what is it called? In my tortilla wraps, I'm okay. So we got this one, it was 440 bob. I freeze my cheese, by the way. And then I got this too. Pasta is a staple in this house, so... I just have to. So we got fusilli. I don't know what it's called. Fusilli or fusilli. I don't know what how it's pronounced. This was 185. And this penne. This one I have to get. Penne gati. This one. A favorite. So this two we really like. So because we buy two packs, I thought let me let me use this instead of the same. So there's two, 185 each, and you can see the brand is, trust me, Santa Maria and Santa Lucia are not playing. They are not in the 100s or the 200s. Please. <laughs> they, those girls are not joking. Then also, I found this Simbabili brand. I saw it online on the Kafo app, and I was like, I'll try it because it is 100 bob for 50 grams. I think I will result to refilling. There are these stores that sell spices. I will look for one and make it my go-to and just refill from there. Because, yeah. For me, it will make more financial sense. So this is the only one I was out of. And uh, these cubes. This chicken one and this beef one. Love, 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 love. These ones are a staple. These ones are always in my kitchen. I always have this. So those are the only spices I needed to restock because I have all the others. All right. These ones I can simply just place them here because they stay here. Anyway, then for my meat I got sausages. Where are my smoothies? Oh, yeah. For my no, let me. Let me finish with everything else first. Blue band, this was on offer for 266 for the 500 gram. This 500 gram was going for 266 bob. And they had written it comes with something free, which I have not seen. So, 66 for that. And then I got butter. This is what I did not get end of last month and i regretted it highly so let me tell you what it costs where is it it's brookside yes brookside for 10 410 unsalted butter this is what i didn't get last month and every time i would start cooking my chicken my beef my pilau i'd be like why didn't i get butter so i made sure this month i have gotten butter and i get unsalted butter all right that's very good even for baking super nice then of course you guys saw me buy this the other day i'm sorry but in this house we go through barbecue sauce quite fast and i highly recommend this one this cup tea one is amazing it's it's everything highly recommend and it's not it's actually cheap amongst all of them it is very cheap it is 259 and then this one is 249 mm. all right this eggless meal and it's also among the cheap ones so 249 to 59 love 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 so yeah got this two and i get eggless because yeah i Let's let's not talk about meal that like eggs. I don't like it. Cause we stopped on my tortilla wraps. These ones were tortilla wrap, 275 bob, a pack of eight. And from last month, I have a remainder. 
I'm remaining with one, one wrap from last month, and I'm remaining with two bands. So you can see how the math is going to math by end month. The math has to math. Okay, so please ensure your math is mathing. That is all. Then now for my mix, I got sandwich ham. We love sandwiches. So this was ham was 304 bob. For how many pieces? How many pieces does it have? I've never really counted them. They have not written. It's not indicated. I can't see. <laughs> I don't know how many they are, but I know it's 304 bob. Then for there's some smokies, yes, that is what it's called. Where is it? Guys, I'm looking at the, the thing, the receipt thing. I can't see. Come on, what is it called? It's farmer's choice. Ham beef. Who is the other one? Okay, 278 for this and 370. For, I'm not understanding this receipt, honestly. But yeah, so I got these two parts. Let me not lie about the price. I don't understand the receipt, but basically I got this part. And last month we got the jumbo pack and we are remaining with jumbo packs and we are only remaining with sausages six sausages are remaining from last month so yeah i thought to just get the small ones because my partner prefers smokies and i also prefer smokies and i use sausages to make pasta you see why they are remaining because no one really fancies them that much then i went ahead and got beef this is a fresh beef chunk bone uh, for a thousand bob this was a thousand bob I got this and then I will get um... <clears throat> no I actually won't get anything else from here I will get uh, beef cubes if I need and I will get beef strips if I need so that's it and I don't think you will need beef strips really because those tortillas taste better with chicken so I don't think I want to try the beef again and then I went ahead and bought my mince meat is squashed. I got mince for 509 bob. This will definitely last us a while. And we have a remainder from last month. This is how much mince meat is left in the freezer from last month. So yeah, it will definitely be enough. So that is it that is my grocery haul in total i spent 6044 shillings and i have the app so yeah i got discount so watch out for that uh, hey that was it uh i'll see you guys uh when we do the pantry clean out and the organization and i will also do the veggies tomorrow so yeah see you guys <laughs> hi guys so the next day i am literally just from the market and i am so exhausted but since i had promised you guys that i would share with you what i get from the market i am here to do that sorry let me close the door hope you guys can see me well so i am here to share what i have gotten from the market so that this monthly haul can be complete i will share prices if i remember because the issue with shopping at the market is you bargain for things to do oh, what is this is better than that so the prices might not be pricing i'm sorry you guys were i needed you to be anyway so the prices sometimes don't price but since you bargain and all that it might be hard for me to say the amount 
but what i remember i will definitely tell you guys but let me tell you people i think the fatigue and just the hassle of walking around carrying things is so worth it because i only get to do it once a month that is all i'm going to say because tell me how for everything i will show you i have spent less than 2000 bob honestly and when i buy things like daily when i say i'm buying my greens every day i'm buying my cabbage every day i'm buying carrots every day that 2000 is spent in a week so just uh, those that get it get it the market is very tight so i got this whole thing of minges i think this was 130 130 i guys love 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 then here i got i got uh three cloves of garlic and two cloves of dania ah sorry of ginger ginger was 20 bob the garlic was 10 and this mishiri is for 120 they're about 120 130 they're about there's there are many i like it and then i got uh two beetroots two beetroots these two were 10 shillings believe it or not two very big beetroots and dania a bunch was 10 shillings but now what i have realized is going to the market actually gives me value for my money because what i've bought at the market for 10 bob for one dania is what i get I, half of it is what I get around here for 10 shillings. So yeah, if you can find the closest market, I've gotten rosemary for 10 shillings. But this one, I am going to plant it. I want to leave the house and go figure where people get these things from. If it is a seed, I am going to buy that seed. And then I've also gotten gorgets, courgettes, gorgets, courgettes, whatever. Two of them each at 10. So that and then i have my bag of tomatoes these tomatoes were going for four at 20. yes four at 20 so i got once for 80 bob but now i wish i had gotten for like 120 but it's fine i can always uh send someone to get them for me but yeah, I have others. The reason I didn't get many, yes, I've remembered. I have tomatoes in, oh, it's water from the Dania. I have like six tomatoes in the fridge. So, got that. And this is uh, Ndengu. No, this is Kamande. It's written here. Kamande a kg for a hundred and, no, for two. Wow, Kamande is so expensive. It's two sixty. And then... Ndengu, I got one kg of Ndengu. We are, I already, I have Kamande in the freezer. There's a bowl full of frozen Kamande in the freezer and I also have some left. That's why. And then the Ndengu, I just got a kg. If I find it for cheaper, I will definitely get another. Yeah. Oops. One tomato was running away. I use, I use serious tomato. And then in here, I have May guys i had missed gideri so badly so i got six of them yeah six this should be enough because you're only going to have gideri twice this month for the sake of sanity and then i got uh yeah i got a kg of onions onions this was 120 120 bob and here this one of it is 10 shillings do the math do the math guys my shoulders are on fire but i just i just need to do this now because once i organize how smart everywhere once i organize these things i won't be able to do the haul and i had promised a, a haul so i got carrots for 20 all this all these ones were 20 shillings so i only got for 20 i didn't want too many then they wither i've realized carrots wither really fast even in the fridge what share your tips on storing carrots in the fridge because for me mine are withering a lot i don't like it so here i have a bag of 
potatoes can you guys see i don't want to put them down they're so muddy a bag of potatoes these were 130 bob for a kg so i got a kg if i there's somewhere i'm going now if i get them there at a cheaper price i'll get another but for now that should do then i got in the fruit department i've gotten pineapple one pineapple this one was 80 bob and then oh i have gotten a watermelon this whole thing this was 250 250 300 300 or 250 i'm not sure then here i have my green guys these greens are me me i don't know how to do this but they are so many. Can you see all these? These are my colored greens. They are those ones. Let me put them in the sink. And then there's also another bunch. These ones. Guys, guess how much these greens were. No, just, just take a guess. A hundred shillings. A hundred shillings i should start farming or open a wholesale store for veggies in the market and make this millions because what and you keep wondering why your you know your local uh lady that sells veggies is has been in business for 20 years and you have changed your career thrice excuse me what i could not believe it the guy was like three bundles for 10 shillings and i remember looking at him like what i buy that one bundle for five guys my life is changed my life is forever changed then we have these babies is it a haul from me is it a grocery haul from me without cabbage no it's not two of these babies each at 50 bob this thing is huge this baby is big each at 50 shillings and that is the haul that is everything i have gotten from the market so right now i will just organize these things in my veggie thingy and yeah wash out my veggies hopefully i can cut them before i leave but yeah, you know what? I'll cut them. That errand I wanted to run today, I'll run it on Saturday. Today I'll only do one. So if I leave here at 4, I'll have enough time. So now it's 1.30. Let's, let's do that. Let's wash everything. Make sure everything is clean. And then we will store it away. And that will be the end of my monthly monthly prep grocery-wise. Alright? So yeah. Let's organize. <laughs> Hi guys, so as I shared earlier, I don't have pantry space except these cabinets and this is what they are looking like right now. I have to step on something to reach here because it's too high. I just want to wipe it down and organize it.
So this is how I have arranged my pantry at the top. I have my tea, I have my pasta back here, I have cornflakes, I have porridge, unga, I have, that is my mans, I have more pasta, uh, my legumes are here, and an extra pack of this cube that we like so much. And then down here I have my rice, ugali unga tea leaves that we don't use no more i feel like disposing them honestly and using this to store like my sugar i just do that this is baking flour these are the no cubes i have my honey just ignore these two things here you guys have seen them so much i'll i'll, I'll sort it later but that's my drinking chocolate and my sugar blue band uh nutella and jam these are things i reach out for real quick that reminds me we don't have tea leaves, tea bags, I'll get that. But anyway, that is it. That is it for the pantry organization for this side. So, yeah. This I organized the other day, so I know it is clean up here. So here I have my sauces. I have some chia seeds back there. And yeah, they are here. And then here I have my spices a bit lower i have my spices they are there i organized that the other day i am not doing that again so basically yeah that is it let me organize my veggies and then we will close off this video
hi guys hours later i am done so i have put my potatoes my minji and um mishiri here my onion garlic and ginger then this maize i want to bamboo i want to remove them uh in the evening then i will store them in the fridge so they are just here for now my pineapple and my watermelon then you guys have seen me cleaning these greens i have just uh let them heat up a bit they have shrunk so i'll store this in the fridge later tonight then i have my washed carrot tomato beetroot uh my courgette the rosemary i've not washed i'll wash that and then i have my washed um dania so that is that is everything i got yeah guys for thank you guys for watching this video that is the those are the groceries i'm going to be using over the month if they end i'll update you at the end of the month but basically that is all i got for the month a few things left like maziwamala for biryani but that i'll get today and avocados which i'll get but thank you so so much guys for watching this video i hope you have enjoyed it i hope it has given you the motivation to go out and shop for your home and stock your house and save those coins because we need to please subscribe if you're not subscribed if you like this kind of content tell me down below i will definitely keep them coming at every end of the month so yeah thank you so much guys for watching make sure you like you comment you share and you subscribe bye